Hey, man. Hey. Scott. You must be Steve. Yes, sir. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. All right, so you called and said you're looking for something Falcon? An Atlanta Falcon helmet, yes, sir. All right, first things first. What kind of budget are we talking about? $400, somewhere in that area. I knew that you were coming, so I went and I pulled all the Falcon stuff. Awesome. Put, put it on a cart. I'm going to bring them out. Let's just start with the basic shell, and then what we're gonna do from there is maybe go over some of the accessories and some of the stuff that we can do and fit you within your budget. But for 400 bucks, we're gonna be able to take a replica helmet and make it amazing. Oh, awesome. Or we can take an authentic helmet and kind of just keep it as is. But I have a feeling you're gonna want something a little bit yeah. out of the ordinary. Yeah, yeah. All right, give me two minutes, I'll be right back. Right. All right, cool. All right, so I pulled a bunch of Falcons helmets. Actually, I pulled all the Falcons helmets that we have. I think he's gonna go for either this one or this one. I want to do a replica because with his budget, we can take this and really, really play with it. If he does an authentic, he's not gonna have really much room in his uh, budget to expand on there, but let's see what he wants to go with. Come on. Oh, yeah. way more than I expected. <laughs> All right, so I brought these in because I wanted to show you selection, but I also wanted to go over the difference with the budget to explain to you if you did say a replica, mm -hmm. which means it has the shell inside, you can't really put mm -hmm. it on your head, you can do a lot. Mm -hmm. If you do an authentic, the shell and all that alone, you're at like the 320 range. Okay. So that doesn't leave you a lot of wiggle room. So you have an option. Okay. You can either expand your budget. We can get really carried away with that or stay in your budget and really deck one of these out. Well, I see the one I want right now. Oh, perfect. I mean, we can we stop this conversation because I see the one I want right now. Tell me. This one is the original Falcon helmet. That's the one I want. Done. Done. So what we're gonna do is take this helmet and we're gonna just go over the things that are currently on it. And then I'm gonna give you some ideas of what we can do with Great. it. I wanna just show you what we're starting with and ask you, do you have anything like in particular that you have to have with this? Or do you have any ideas even what you wanna do with it? I not a lot of ideas. I, you know, I know there's like a lot of hot face masks out there these days and all lots of times it says Falcons on the front, things like that. But, you know, you're the artist. I came to you guys. I've seen what you guys can do. Okay. Um, I'd love to see what you can do if you just take it and run with it. So I appreciate that. You're not opposed to me changing anything you see on here. Not at all. Okay. Because by the time I'm done with this, the only thing that's going to be the same is the red helmet and the decals. That'll be cool. Okay. That'll I'm be awesome. Gonna, I'm gonna go have fun with this. You need to come back tomorrow. I have to wait that long. Yes, sir. Okay, yep. all right. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna go into the studio with it now and we're gonna do the proper green gridiron treatment. All right, now that we're finished talking with Scott, I have a real good idea of what I'm gonna do for him. And let's go over all the pieces with you real quick and then I'm gonna throw this thing together. So yeah, we're gonna go with this throwback Falcons helmet that he really wanted. I agree with him. The face mask is something that we just have to change. What I'm gonna do is put on a black HS4 face mask. And the reason is because the HS4 version will accept a shock zero G plus visor really nicely. And with the black, with the smoke out look is going to look really great. Couple that with a black sports star victory T-Rex hurricane chin strap with white sports star buckles, blackout American flag, blackout warning label. We're going to take the Under Armour visor clips and I'm going to black them out with the decals. Of course, the built by green gridiron decal and check these out. Real deal 3D bumpers. We're gonna throw them on there for him. And to top it all off, we're hooking Scott up with a helmet hanger so he can display his helmets like you see on the wall behind me. I'll be right back and you're gonna to get to see this thing in a whole new way.
Here we go. All right. Look at this, huh? You know, I think that this old school throwback, whatever you want to call it, Falcon's design is so good. But the gray mask that was on there, the way that it came out of the box, compared to what it looks like now, it is not even close. This is so awesome. We took that soft cup chin strap off, which was white with the stainless buckles and that gray mask, and we blacked out the front of this thing and made it a true Dirty Bird special. The 3D bumpers, the black decals in the rear, this should really make an impression with Scott. I hope that he's happy because he put a lot of pressure on me. Uh, so here's what's gonna happen now. We're gonna wipe this thing down, we're going to box it back up, and we're going to meet Scott, who should be coming in shortly, and do the big reveal. Let's hope he likes it. Right. All, All right. right. All right. So who's, who's this? This is my wife, Jackie Lee. Jackie Lee, this is Steve, the man hey, who's making Steve. my dreams come true. How are you? How are you? I'm good. I'm All good. right. All right. What do, you, what do you think about all this? Uh, I think it's madness, but... <laughs> <laughs> that means you're on to something. Yes. Yeah. Yes. All right. So I got to ask you, first off, this looks so good. Well, let's uh, see it. No, no. So why, why the Falcons? What, what's happening here? Well, I grew up a Falcon fan, and all my life, been a Falcon fan. This shirt I'm wearing, Steve Bartkowski, childhood hero. Okay. Um, the significance of this helmet is it's the first Falcon helmet. It's got a gold stripe on it. I'm a Georgia Tech fan. When the Falcons were founded, they were red and black, and somebody said, hey, you're leaving the Georgia Tech people in Atlanta out, so they put a gold stripe on it. So that's why this helmet means so much to me. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So do you have, how many helmets do you have in your collection? I have two so far, two Georgia Tech helmets. And this will make three. This will make three. How long, have, like when did you start collecting? Started collecting uh, this summer when one of your employees uh, gave me one as a gift and started this crazy <laughs> ha hobby that I now have. All right. Where do you see this going? Like, are you gonna are you gonna have a? We have a room that are gonna be filled <laughs> with helmets. Yes, that's what happens, man. Yes. It yes. gets addictive. I'm, I'm, a, I'm I'm hooked. All right. Well, just know that we are, of course, always here for you whenever you want to play. Sorry, but doors are always open. I won't torture you anymore. All right, let's look at. Take it. a look at this. Let me know what you All think right. that we did. I can't wait. Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Yeah. Oh man. my goodness. And then we threw in a uh, helmet hanger for you so you can oh. properly display that. Wow. Let, let me go over what we did with you so you know exactly what you're looking at. Wow. I, and I know you care so much too. So, <laughs> so really cool. as promised, I didn't touch the shell or the decals, changed off that gray face mask for HS4 style, and this is stainless steel, so this is very, very lightweight. Um, the HS4 means high strength stainless steel. Uh, because of that, you can tell it has these two lines here, mm -hmm. and it has this little indent, and because of that, we were able to use a Shock Zero G Plus visor, which is really designed for the Speed Flex helmet. Uh, but we used a really proper mask on this so we can do this nice smoke look. We did branded Under Armour visor clips, but then blacked them out with these little decals Beautiful. so it kept the black and white. Beautiful. This is a Sports Star Victory T-Rex Hurricane chin strap. This is what the guys are wearing on the Chin NFL. strap's awesome. This is what they're wearing on the field. Black face mask hardware, white Sports Star buckles just to give it that all black and white forward look. Pops. And on the back, we took that factory warning label off, put on a gloss black one, put on your black American flag so it just shines through. On the inside, you got your built by Green Gridiron seal of approval. And this, my friend, is now all wow, yours. Wow, I can't thank you enough. You guys just blew me away. I had, When you said you could jazz it up, I had no idea what you were coming back with. Um, this is beyond anything that I could have imagined. This is so cool. It's so good, man. And by the way, 
all in, you're at 407. Wow, <laughs> so way to go, man! Right we, on the right, right on the right we, price. We did it. We did it. Awesome, yep, awesome. We did it. Awesome. You enjoy that. I'm going to tell everybody how they can get involved if they want to be on YouTube. Okay, so if you want to have a YouTube experience, go to the video description and click the link, which will take you to GreenGridIron.com, and you can book a date and a time. You come in just as Scott did. You can either trust my judgment or you can tell me exactly what it is that you want and maybe you can be on the show. You can be in the studio with me, you can build the thing yourself if you want. Scott opted to wait for the surprise, which I, I'm kind of glad yeah. that that's what yeah. we did. Yeah. So thank you so much for trusting me. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching and for sticking around until the end. And that's it, man, we're gonna say goodbye. So until next time, cheers. Thanks, man. Awesome, man. Dude, really.